Hi there, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a fake background for your YouTube videos for free. So the tools we are going to use in this video is basically going to be free and I'm going to teach you everything step by step with no step skip. In this era of AI, you don't need to invest so much into equipment, especially if you're a beginner and don't have the capital to start, then this video is actually going to help you. Even if you're a pro, this video is going to help you. Subscribe if today is your first time. And don't forget to turn on post notification. We're going to start straight forward and let's look at the two videos that we're going to create. And then let's look at the videos we're going to create. So this is a fake video, fake background, and then this is the original video. And you can see there are a series of videos I created using this method. So let's jump right into this. The first tool we're going to use is Canva. Canva is completely free. If you want a pro version, the first 30 days is free. You just create a free account and then you can upgrade to pro. And the free version should be and the free version should be enough to do this for you. So let's go to Canva. I've already signed up. So go ahead and click on create a design. And here, let's and here let's go to custom size. I'm going to set it at 920. The width and then the height is going to be 1080 pixels. And then let's click on create new design. So this is what we're going to do. When you open the page, just go to elements. And then scroll down until you see AI image generator. That is what we're going to do. So click on this, generate your own. And then here, enter five plus words to describe whatever you want to do. So just describe whatever image you want. In my case, I want image about a studio background because my videos are about recording. So I want a cutting edge studio environment, a futuristic look, incorporating your lighting ascent in blue or whatever purple so this is actually what i want so i'll go ahead and click on generate image whoa so you can see i got four amazing images i can use so all we need to do is to add this to our background so click on that So this has been added to my background. I need to resize this to fit on the background. Okay, so this is it. This is my first image. If you want more pages, you can click on the plus icon to add a page. And then I want to add another image. Then I want to add another image. I'll go ahead and resize this as well. Okay, I want to do this for the third time. I will equally resize this. And there we go. I think this is cool. Now the next thing we need to do is to download this. So go to share and go to download. And then I'll stick to the PNG and then this is about three pages and I'm going to download all. So this is going to be separate pages. So click on download. This will be downloaded as a zip file. So we first need to extract this. So these are the three images I'm going to use for my background. So these are the three images I'm going to use for my background. Now let's go to CapCut. Okay, so I'm on CapCut. Basically, I edit my video using Adobe Premiere Pro, but I want everything. I want everything, but I want everything to be completely free for you to use. You don't need to pay anything. So. You don't need to pay anything. So CapCut should do everything for you. You don't need to pay anything. So now on CapCut, just go to the media session and then upload your videos and then images. Now, what you can see over here is that I've already done that. I've uploaded my images and then my videos. I have everything over here. I got these videos from Pizzles. So you can go to Pizzles and then download videos there and then use. Now, what we're going to do is to start adding this to our timeline. So you can just drag them to our timeline. So the first thing I want to do is that I'm going to bring my background here or have more background I can add. So I can just click on upload file.
and then add more backgrounds okay so we can just drag the background to the timeline like this so this is my amazing background that i generated using the ai now we need to add our video on top of that so i have a video here that i want to use so i can just drag this video on top as well okay so this is my video and then i'll drag the timeline to fit with the same length of my video perfect so now select the video and then we actually need to remove the background of this video that is amazing so if you use CapCut, this should be easy to do. So just go to the Smart Tools over here and we have the Remove Background. There's amazing you can do enhance color corrections and all that. But I'm not going to teach that here. I'm just going to show you how to actually... I'm just going to show you how you can actually replace the background. So go to Remove Background. And then let's use the Auto Remover. Just check that. It's going to automatically remove the background for you. And there we have it. You can see how amazing this is going to look like. You can play this and see how this is going to look like. So this is a completely fake background. And it doesn't look like it's fake. And it's just amazing. So this is basically what we just achieved. You can actually do auto, do auto color corrections. You can just go to basic here. And you can see auto color adjustment. You can actually go there and then apply the AI color correction over here. It's actually completely for free. You can do that. But I'm going to stick to this. We've been able to change this. And then we have our amazing background here. And that is actually amazing. So now that we have this background, we can actually export this as your video. And use it whatever you want to use it. So imagine, so imagine you recorded this in your room. Your room is not arranged in the manner in which you want then you can use this method once you are done go to export and then let's go to download you can actually share this directly to tiktok uh, youtube and then the rest or facebook but i just want to download this so go to download and then you can give it any name you want i'm just going to stick with the default name the resolution i'm cool with this the 720 is also okay but let me just stick to this and then the quality recommended quality i'll stick to that but if you want to change to high quality it's also amazing you can do that and then the frame rate i'm going to stick to 30 fps and then the format because it's video i'm going to stick to the mp4 and then click on the spot that is amazing so now my video is exported i cannot download it So I've done this and this is amazing you can actually keep changing the background use different video and the method is basically the same so if I delete this background this is my video with a transparent background I can actually add another background here which is this I can actually add another background just beneath this because my video already is not having any background so you can see I've been able to change this background as well so I can just go ahead I can just go ahead and resize this to fit to the length of this and if I play this for you to see and it's still unique and amazing you can do auto color corrections like i said and this is, this is even going to make it even more amazing so let me download this as well so let me download this as well go to export once again and then i'll stick to the same format and then download this Okay, so this is very amazing. I'm going to do this for the last video here. Let me just show you something very unique. This works for even complex videos. So I'm going to actually drag a new video to my timeline here. So this is another video here. So let's actually use the same method on this video. I'm going to delete this background. And then let me use this unique studio background for this as well. Okay, so I'm going to resize this, just zoom in a bit, zoom out a bit, and then I can just fit this right here. So don't worry about the video because we're just going to remove the background. So don't worry if it fits completely on the screen. So select the video here. Let's go to the smart tools and then go to remove background. Let's use the auto remover.
and there we have it this is even amazing this is even amazing let's play this and see wow okay so this is basically amazing and you can do this on yourself you don't need to pay for any tool to do this if you like this video remember to subscribe and turn on post notification and you have any suggestion as well share it at the comment section we'll be doing a lot of amazing videos right here on this channel so this is your preferred channel for everything tech subscribe and then let me know what you think about this video and share with friends as well so the same method you can just go ahead and export this and remember your video can be with audios and all that there's nothing wrong with that because i'm just doing demonstration i'm just using these videos to do that for you to see i will export this finally and download it thank you so much for watching this video till i come away again remember to always subscribe to my channel and turn on post notification bye bye